Be still. Be still and know that God is love. Begin to meditate. Slow down your whole thinking process, your whole body. Come to a place of rest. Relax. Fix your attention. Fix your eyes on Jesus. Fix your eyes on the Father. And let unconditional love begin to surround you. As you breathe in deeply, breathe in the unconditional love of the Father. Feel his unconditional love for you. Be still and let God love you. Be still so you can know the power of unconditional love. Be still and know. Know by experience. Father, release the experiences of unconditional love to everyone who's listening right now, everyone who will listen in the future. Let unconditional love, the power of unconditional love, overwhelm them. Let the fire of your love purify and refine their hearts. Show each one the way you see them. Show each one what you've forgiven them for. Let them see the triumphant nature of your mercy and grace and love in their lives. Give them a testimony to share. Let the oracles of the Father's heart those frequencies surround you. Passion. Let the frequency of God's passion for you and for all his children, let it resonate in your heart. Let it resonate with your heart, mind and emotions. Let it vibrate with energy and life. Let the frequency of burning desire, God's burning desire for you and for all his children, let feel it, sense it, let that frequency bring you into agreement with it and resonate with you. Feel the intense joy, the frequency of his intense joy when he looks at you. And when he looks at all his children, he feels intense joy. He rejoices over you. No matter what you've done, no matter who you are, he rejoices over you. As he rejoices over all his children, feel it, vibrate with it, be energized by it. Feel his deep compassion. Let that frequency of deep compassion vibrate in your very deeper innermost being. Feel the way he shows his compassion to you. That you might feel that compassion to others. Feel it. His compassion. He cares for you. He loves you and feel that overwhelming love, a love which will never give up, never cease, never stop, never fail, that we cannot be separated from. Feel the frequency of that love. Let it energize you to be able to love others the way you have been loved, the way God loves you, the way God loves them. Be a voice for unconditional love. Be a testimony for unconditional love. Feel that powerful love of God. If you desire to receive the knowledge, the truth, the experiences of that consuming fire of God's presence, 
I encourage you to ask the Father, ask Jesus to take you there. Ask Jesus to show you for yourself those that can be rescued from the fire who don't yet know how to receive his love. I ask you, Father, to open up that realm. Let Jesus walk with them as Prince of Peace, as the suffering servant who came to seek and to save those who were lost. Let Jesus take you through wisdom's heights, through the fiery door, through Satan's trophy room, into the fire of God's loving presence. That consuming fire. Let him show you those who were there in self-inflicted torment and pain and anguish of soul. Let Jesus show you how to share the good news, how to feel his compassion and share his compassion and love to those who were in torment, in anguish. Let the unconditional love of God be released. Open up your hearts and if you're willing, be willing to go wherever he takes you, to experience whatever he shows you. Maybe you feel you're not ready for that yet, that's okay. Just stay in that place, cocooned in the love of God yourselves. Maybe you feel unworthy to share the good news. Ask him to forgive you. Although he's already forgiven you, sometimes we just need to acknowledge, to receive that forgiveness. To receive, maybe, forgiveness for being judgmental, for carrying bitterness or resentment, or judging people in the flesh, for judging people for what they've done, for being hard-hearted towards people, If you have any experiences of that, be willing, just let them go. Lay them at his feet. Ask him to empower you to love unconditionally. Just going to wait for a few minutes for you to experience whatever you need to experience. Just stay in that place of love.
stay in that place if you're still experiencing whatever God is showing you, just stay in that place.